All right, well, it's time to take you back to the Opry. This time, no presidents, but if there could be a president of country music, let's be honest, it would probably be Dolly. National Insider's Adam Wardsell went to the Opry House where Dolly had a big milestone to celebrate. It is always an honor to be in the presence of a legend, and tonight here at the Grand Ole Opry, I think it is safe to say that we are in the presence of probably the most famous female country artist in history, and she is getting a legendary honor on her 50th anniversary of being a member of the Grand Ole Opry. Let's see what Dolly has to say. The night that I actually became a member, after I was working with the Porter Wagner Show, and got to actually be a member 50 years ago this year, uh, it was one of the highlights of my whole life because it was a true dream of mine. And I just wish Mom and Daddy could be here tonight, but I think they are. As you know, we've, I've been doing some movies uh, for Netflix based on uh, so songs I've written. I, I've done eight shows that are going to drop in November, and they're based on songs like Jolene and Two Doors Down, uh, several songs. And then hopefully, and I just did a musical, Christmas musical that will be on next Christmas. I wrote all the songs for that. And all the dancing and all, I felt like a Broadway star. But I'm actually uh, playing a, a big part in that. I'm acting in that as well. So I'm, um, I'm excited about that. So I'm going to probably, hopefully, try to take off a little bit of time right after the first of the year. Just getting out here and trying to, you know, be here to say, hey, these dreams have come true. So you've got to continue to support them. So, you know, everybody's dreams don't come true. And I have been so fortunate to see so many of my dreams come true. And I don't take any of it for granted. As I often say, I count my blessings a lot more than I count my money. This may be Dolly's 50th anniversary as a member of the Grand Ole Opry, but the queen of country music has been performing in that famous circle at the Grand Ole Opry House for six decades. What a career, still going strong. Casey? Back over to you. Thanks so much for watching this week's Nashville Insider feature. If you liked what you saw, be an insider and hit the subscribe button. Also check out our friends Summer and Bray on their YouTube channel. And if you want to see full episodes of Nashville Insider, go to countryroadtv.com and use the code INSIDER when you sign up to get a free month. Thanks again for watching. We'll see you next week.